Hi, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we are reviewing a pen that was sent to us by Caveco for review purposes. This is the Caveco Perkeo in the, the color uh, that is the old chambray. This pen comes inside this plastic sleeve and says Caveco uh, Germany since 1883 and here right on and it opens like this and we take the pen off the pen is just like the other perkyo i already reviewed um, it is a plastic pen you can see it is an, an, an expensive pen uh, it has lots of assets here i think 16 on the on the barrel and eight on the cap, just like the cap of the Caveco Sport. Um, on the cap there is engraved Caveco, Germany. I think you can see it. Here there is the typical Caveco logo in this metallic medallion. There is this groove around the, um, the medallion, which is, um, which is for... Um, security purposes because this is a school pen if you swallow this cap you still can breathe through this this opening around the, the top of the of the cap and here you have also uh, the same kind of opening for security reasons on the on the end of the barrel the cap is blue and the barrel is just white. Um, this pen has no clip. There are there is no clip that you can put in this pen. The 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 Caveco Sport clip won't fit on this. This is too large. And maybe you don't really need one because this is a school pen. And one thing that students um, that children destroy on their pens usually first is the is the clip that gets broken so i think that's the reason why there is no clip for this pen also the clip wouldn't be needed as a roller stop because it has these facets that don't allow the pen to roll too easily off the desk the cap fits by pressure and when you take off the cap you'll see a blue uh, band between the section and the, the barrel and another blue piece here just before the nib the nib is a steel nib this one is an m nib and it is um, just steel with the, the natural color um, if you unscrew the section, you'll have room for two cartridges, short international cartridges, or two for one long international cartridge. This part of the section threads is um, transparent, maybe to be easier to see the ink level. Though it, well, it isn't really necessary, but maybe this is the reason. Um, then we have the section and the section has this triangular shape and I already told these about the summer, uh, Indian summer uh, pen that the, these, um, this side of the section gets to uncomfortable over these over over the, the finger when writing but maybe this is really good for students that are learning to write uh, for me i don't really like this almost sharp edge here uh, the pen has a very good size it's a big pen you can post it it posts securely but it gets to 
heavy on the top and too long. It's just great to write like this. Just for comparison purposes, here we have a Lamy Safari, almost the same size, and a Parker Centennial Du Fold, almost also the same size. So this is a big pen, great for smaller hands of uh, students. Um, so let's just see how it writes. Let's make just a short uh, writing test. The pen is the Aveco Perkeo with an M nib. This, this version is the old chambray. There are other three uh, color schemes for this pen. Um, the ink is the Caveco Paradise Blue and the, um, the paper is the Rhodia dot pad. This nib is really, really smooth. It writes very well, uh, but you can have some line variation, you have to press hard. Uh, I'm not a fan of um, really flexible nibs, so this is n nothing that I would try for myself. It is a good, uh, a good nib, it delivers a good amount of ink, but it is not a wet nib, although it delivers well. One uh, strange thing about this nib is that although it is M, it performs like F. It's not a medium line that you get, you get a, a fine line. Overall, this is a nice pen. Um, there are some things I don't love so much, uh, like the, particularly the section, but this is a school pen, so it's intended for children and for young students to learn how to write with fountain pens, and I think it is a good pen for that uh, purpose. So, thank you. Uh, for watching the video. Thank you to Caveco for sending us this pen for review. Um, we'll soon publish a full written review about this pen and please follow our blog and subscribe to our, to our YouTube channel. Goodbye, see you next time.